G'day guys and welcome to Primal Waters. Today we're going to be looking at the sequel to The Meg. Now it's been a few months since we've heard any updates or official updates on the film on what's happening. I think the last update was around about uh, March and some of those stories are, um, uh, you know, I've, I've, I've talked about in the past but uh, what's happening with Jason Statham's uh, The Meg 2. The Meg is happening and it's going to be the greatest film. The Meg is getting a sequel. So their stories from November to March this year. Uh, I do know that uh, the green light uh, they've been given the green light to uh, to create or start the the script for the film. Um, but apart from that, there's uh, not a lot of information out there. So all I can probably pass on to you guys today is uh, those of you who are not familiar with the Meg series, uh, the Meg. Uh, it's based off of uh, several books written by Steve Alton. He's the author of uh, the, the original Meg, a novel, Deep Terror, and there's a few other novels in the series, The Trench, Primal Waters, Hell's, uh, Hell's Aquarium, uh, Night Stalkers, Generations, and there's uh, an Origins one, and also uh, we've got so The Purgatory is coming out, I think, in the next couple of years. He's got some other novels as well called The Lock, uh, he's got the sequel, The Lock, coming out uh, later this year or early next year. And there's a few other ones, um, uh, other different types of novels uh, that might interest you, like to do with UFOs and stuff like that. But uh, The Trench is a sequel to the uh, the mega novel Deep Terror. And I'll just, I've got the novel in my hand now. I'll just read what's on the back of it. The ocean will never be safe. They thought it was over. Meg, the prehistoric 60-foot great white shark, is dead, and her female megalodon pup is safely imprisoned within the Tanaka Lagoon. But outside, hundreds of male great whites are gathering, drawn by the scent of a mature female, and the pup is now grown to a 72-foot, and she's ready to breed. So the shark in this one is quite terrifying. Her name is Angel, uh, Angel of Death. Um, she is one of the pups that was uh, born from the first... Uh, megalodon in the first novel and uh and she gets out and causes a lot of havoc uh, really good read and uh, i'm assuming um that uh, uh what we've ha did here is that uh, they're going to try and not try and, but they are going to go a lot closer to the novel now with the first uh, movie uh, the meg um you could see elements that are based off of the novel but there was a lot of differences between the novel and the the movie itself but i was pretty happy with the film um, but i'm kind of hoping in the sequel they um kind of stick closely to the novel uh, make the film a lot darker and scarier i think they can uh, take a risk and do that uh, a lot of people enjoyed the first film I'm pretty confident that those people who enjoy it will go back and see the sequel and with the sequel um, uh, enjoy it um, a different viewpoint I guess uh, give uh, give the audience a terrifying experience on uh, what would happen if one of these creatures uh, still existed today and uh, and in the uh, the sequel novel there's uh, we get introduced to another prehistoric uh, creature that is uh, living down in the Marianas trench as well so that'd be a good introduction to um, some new creatures uh, on the big on the big screen as well, which would be quite uh, awesome actually. So, but uh, apart from that, guys, there's uh, not a lot of uh, information out there. Uh, hopefully, in the next few months we might start hearing uh, maybe the plot of the film. Um, but uh, until then, I'm going to continue on and talk about the rest of Steve Alton's Meg series um, novels and just let you guys know about them. And, um, so, you know, if you're interested in uh, buying these books, uh, you can definitely go check Steve Alton's um, uh, online store or his uh, webpage, stevealton.com. And uh, he's got plenty of novels there for sale. And, uh, and you know, if you're into shark stories, I definitely highly recommend going reading, reading the Meg series uh, from there. So, but... Uh, until then, I'll, uh, hopefully you guys will keep continue watching my YouTube channel and uh, all the news shark updates I'll give you and other stories that I'll come across uh, for the uh, Primal Waters channel. So that's it, guys. Uh, thanks for tuning in. Drop a comment down below, hit that like button, share this video. Um, thank you for watching, and until next time, I'll see you in the next video. Bye for now.